Hey everybody, I've got exciting news. Uh, just this week, uh, we've worked on finalizing uh, the Libri View integration with our Bubble product uh, using the uh, application, which is uh, currently not part of Bubble, but it is part of the community. Uh, this is called Diabox, and it is the app that we're promoting and suggesting that folks use to integrate their Bubble uh, with uh, their lives and also to the Libri View, which is used by your doctor typically uh, to monitor your glucose levels. So let's show you the new feature. Over here in settings, if we go into integration, not only can you integrate everything uh, with the Night Scout credentials, and for those of you not familiar with Night Scout, I'll quickly digress and go over here. Uh, this is a server that's in the cloud. It's open source. It is free. It is being hosted by Heroku app, which is also free up to a certain amount of hours per month. But the amount of hours that you use per month never seem to exceed the amount that you would need. So in essence, it's still free. So Night Scout is definitely a free option, which is great. Uh, if you're not sure what that is, give us a call. We'll be more than happy to consult with you and uh, you can hire us to set it up for you and we'll be more than happy to do that. Now, back to what it is that uh, we want to go ahead and show here, which is going to be the Libri View. All right, so going back uh, to the application, all you need to do to enable LibreView is to enable uh, this little switch over here. By default, it's off when you turn it on. All you have to do is provide your username and your password to the LibreView. Now, if you're like me, I never had a reason to log into the internet, but my doctor did have a um, an access to it on his back end. So let me jump over here to LibreView link which is the app that you use to uh, read your um, sensor natively without using the technology of Bubble, right? So what you do is when you set this up, you have to create uh, a, an account. And so with that, you have your account settings and password. That is the same account that you're going to use to log in to LibreView. And so since Bubble USA only sells to other people here in the United States. Uh, to log into the LibreView, you're going to go to www1, or sorry, three W's, one, LibreView.com, and you're going to use the same credentials to log in. And so once you've done that and you've logged in, it'll ask you to connect your Libre Freestyle Reader with uh, you know, a cable to your PC so you can upload the data. Well, with the integration of Diabox and Bubble, uh, you no longer have to worry about doing that. The integration simply will make it all show up. So up here, there's two switchers. You have the device to upload the data and then the glucose history, which is where you're going to want to be after you've connected uh, the device over um, in the in the application. Let me bring that up real quick again. So we'll get out of this. Whoop, it's hard to drive a, a phone in a, in a, on screen here. All right, so back over here, again under settings, under integration. After you've gone ahead and connected this, uh, the information will be updated every 15 minutes uh, into the uh, Libri View portal. And if you go down here, you can go uh, into glucose reports and we can go to daily log and then I'll page down to today's date and you'll see that I've got all of the data now uh, as of this morning going back eight hours. And so you can see that this is now connected. Now the benefit for this is using the bubble uh, the bubble will take readings from your uh, from your sensor using NFC technology to connect to it, but then the bubble wirelessly via Bluetooth connects to your phone, and then that new app on the phone, the Diabox app, will upload that data, kind of sling it right up into the LibreView, which is what your doctor will use to log in to see your readings, or you can come and uh, you know into LibreView and print this information out for your endocrinologist if for some reason they don't have LibreView for the for the physicians in any event great long awaited feature um, the solution is now coupled and very tightly with you know with your doctor again as a disclaimer bubble is just a piece of hardware that is what we are we are not a medically approved device please use blood tests to make life-altering decisions as it relates to your health 
our technology simply provides a convenience for you, but again, it is not to be relied on for any medical diagnosis. Um, the technology is there to help educate you and to try to help make your lives a little bit easier. So with that being said, uh, we look forward, if you're not already, uh, to being a Bubble customer, and we'll see you soon in the next video. Thank you.